also why uh, why Matlock Bath? What's that all about? Well, it transpires. I uh, did a little bit of research before coming out. But uh, back in the late 1700s, uh, a natural spring was found in uh, just south of the town of Matlock, uh, at what is now Matlock Bath. Uh, and so around that spring, which was uh, heralded as having life-giving powers, people used to go there to bathe in the spring and to uh, drink its water. Around that area, uh, obviously, you start to get built up, and in Victorian times, it became a very um, posh spa town, a bit like a mini bath proper, if you see what I mean. Uh, bath proper being the one down near Bristol. Um, so I assume the springs are still there, but uh, anyway, it grew up as a fashionable place to be, and uh, it's in a very steep sided valley. Um, and you've got the uh, river obviously running down that valley, and then there are buildings that sort of front off onto it, on like a promenade. So it's uh, you know one of those typically Victorian places to uh, go and promenade on a summer's evening. And anyway, it's remained uh, it's remained a little popular spot since now. Of course, it's a top tourist venue, and I'm assuming it's going to be uh, coffee shops and all that kind of caper. Anyway, never been there myself. Looking forward to uh, to having a look. So I've only got. Uh, 2.8 miles to run now, so uh, stay tuned. So many bikes around here, it's great. I've stopped nodding and waving at them now because I was just getting worn out. There's only so much of that you can do. Oh, and I've just remembered the river that runs through Matlock Bath is actually the River Derwent as well. And just as an extra little Matlock Bath fact there for you. Here is the town of Matlock itself. Picturesque spa town, apparently, called to the sign. Oh, this is rather delightful. Victorians were right, it's a very nice spot. now just coming up to the bit that uh, you see in all the pictures of Matlock Bath which is the uh, the area where there's very steep cliffs or a steep cliff. I do want to do a bit of filtering on it. And then you should see all the uh, villas on the one side of the bank. And not much on the other. TVR Car Club must be out. Excellent. Former member myself. Very nice Tuscans. Excellent. The Griffith, a Tuscan. The Griffith. Oh, there's an old S. I used to have one of those. Nice. I've never seen so many TBRs. I've done a few TBR meets in my time. Excellent. car going overhead. How exciting! Okay, a bit more filtering then. It's going to be the way it's done. Gosh, canoeing in the rapids, it's all happening here. Well, it's so heaving actually, I'm not sure I'm actually going to bother to stop here. I might just uh, ride through and take a look for a view of the bikes already parked up. And this is Bike Fest. Wow, the place is heaving. There's me wondering if there'd be any bikes here. Tiger there, excellent. I actually hate riding places like this because there are bikes everywhere and you don't know if something's going to come up inside you, around the outside of you, what they're going to do. Unbelievable. What a spot. 
obviously the popular spot. One of them. Well, the machines here are all much loved. There's no commuters here. They're all Sunday rides. They've been polished to death. Excellent. Like it. Transmans on the outside. Do okay. go there. This is the Victorian facade. GS popped in there. I've never seen as many bikes anywhere ever. This is amazing. What a lovely little town. You've really got a lot of bikes, haven't you? So glad of the GS's light clutch on here. Unbelievable. Brilliant. Well, really enjoyed that. Well worth a ride down here, just to have a look through. Hope you got a glimpse of that. Hope the uh, camera picks that up. Uh, excellent. Let's come down sometime on a quiet night and, uh, and have a look around. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that little uh, ride through the Peak District. I think we can call the Peak District done for this year. I'm sure we'll be back again next year. Some amazing riding to be done here. So I look forward to speaking to you next time. Until then, this has been the Messenger Fly. Cheerio.